hear it all the time that AI is getting cheaper, more accessible, and greener. But what if that's not the full picture? What if the real cost of AI on just financials, but also about the power, access, and sustainability? I'm Subrata Kar, and today on the Forge POV, we are exposing three AI myths that could cost you more than you think. Myth number one, AI is getting cheap, but for whom? Sure, AI inference, like using pre-trained models, is becoming cheaper. But training cutting-edge models, that's more expensive than ever. We are talking about massive investments, thousands of GPUs and billions in infrastructure. The truth, only the AI giants, Google, Microsoft, Amazon of the world, can afford that. So while AI usage is getting cheaper, AI creation is getting more concentrated. Myth number two, AI is fully democratized, not so fast. Governments are pouring billions into national AI infrastructure. The US Stargate project alone is a $500 billion initiative. But here is the catch. Just because you can access GPUs doesn't mean you can access the power of AI needed to make the difference. Compute power alone is in the whole story. Breakthrough AI needs proprietary data sets, cutting edge research, and specialized talents. And who gets the first dips on these resources? Startups, independent researchers, and smaller players who could still find themselves locked out. Plus, regulatory and geopolitical barriers. Will these AI hubs remain open or will access be controlled by policy and politics? True democratization of AI isn't just about giving everyone the tools. It's about making sure everyone can build and scale AI, not just the privileged few. Myth number three, more AI tools equal more accessibility. Not quite. Platforms like AutoML and SageMaker make it easier to use AI. But here is the real challenge. Building and scaling AI at the frontier, that requires more than just tools. It requires compute, data, and expertise. And these resources are still controlled by a few players. Think of it this way. Having a car doesn't mean you own the highway. AI tools help, but without open access to compute and proprietary models, real innovation is still gated. But there is more to the hidden cost than just access. Let's talk about two crucial issues. Number one, bias. AI is only good as the data it learns from. And if the data is flawed, AI can amplify discrimination at scale. Number two, sustainability. AI's energy consumption is rising sharply. Without a push for green AI, we could be trading one problem for another. Worse environmental impact even as we solve the other issues. So what's the solution? Instead of chasing generalized AI, we need to focus on domain-specific AI that solves real-world problems efficiently. Let's embrace smarter alternatives like vertical AI. Focus on specific sectors and industries to create impactful solutions. Age AI. Bring AI closer to the users, reducing dependence on massive centralized models. Green AI. Invest in renewable energy and carbon-efficient AI infrastructure to mitigate environmental harm. The future of AI isn't just about making it cheaper. It's about making it fairer, smarter, and more sustainable for everyone. If you want the full story, check out my deep dive in the Spark Digest newsletter. Subscribe the link below. Stay ahead of the curve. Thanks for tuning into the Forge POV. And goodbye for now.